Hello and welcome fellow gamers, my name is Borek and this is another episode of 7 Days to Die. In the previous episode, we've looted, we have looted the shotgun messiah. Yeah, and we came back with lots of, lots of uh, parts. And on my way back, I've managed to... I need to sort these things out, and I've managed to gather, uh, kill some animals. Actually, I killed one dog and uh, two deers, which were somewhere, which were running somewhere close. So that was lucky thing, and I got some materials. So anyway, uh, so we have enough materials to make finally, to finally make a bellows. Right, and we have a wood animal hide, so let's craft that and after that we're gonna make a forge We're gonna make ourselves a forge, but I'm not gonna place the forge uh, Near here near our base near our sleeping point and I need man. I don't have mm, I Need to make a bedroll As well because uh, my spawn point is located somewhere up there. Yeah, there's the spawn point in the bunker and I don't want to you know if I die I don't I don't want to uh, go there oh we have a safe over here which is good so I'm gonna place the forge over here because if uh, those not screamers but um, screamer zombies yeah that's what they are called if the screamer zombies uh, came in the area they will be somewhere around there and not uh, where my exit where my exit is so let's make a forge itself finally I'm falling behind with that but yeah it's gonna be a-okay and uh, do I have a wrench on me yes I do so I'm gonna take apart this this bed oh you can take apart even more good Nope, you cannot take apart <laughs> the safe. That's not that's not the case. And I'm gonna put all the stuff, the metal stuff, in there. I have calipers with me, and I have I have an anvil which we have found in somewhere. And yeah, uh, th this is how I'm gonna spend night tonight. And let me just place. Ah, I always misclick that. Finally, we have made ourselves a forge this way we can we can make a forged iron we can smelt those we can add this this is really a good source of good source of fuel so these are burning away already which is good i don't know if you're gonna lose anything let me just check okay so if you add one can, you will get five. So let's drop the iron and if I scrap it, I'm gonna get one iron and... Ah, shit. If I add one iron, I will get five. So there's no point on of keeping them so let's scrap this and let's just add where is it oh these were the match of them is being scrapped right so this is 10 good so these will go in this way we can make ourselves a forged iron where is it forged iron requires clay so let's drop some clay in there as well this way we can make Ooh. Iron fence, good, nice. So there's a lots of things we can make. Cooking grill, good. Cooking grill. Although, do I have a cooking grill? I don't know. But I need that forged iron because, yeah, I need to repair my tools. So let's actually get as much as we can. Right now, and let's repair that pickaxe of ours well yeah and what I wa actually want to do as well is destroy I'm gonna destroy the stairs because I don't want to no zombies oh shit it's gonna take a while to take it apart 
because the plan of action is if the zombies get into the uh, building they will go up the stairs and if there's no block over here they will drop down so no biggie uh, if I destroy it they won't be able to uh, get me okay guys so I'm gonna uh, be destroying the stairs at least here and then I'm gonna go down to secure the place as well and we'll see how it goes although I need I'm gonna go and upgrade it a bit this way we will do more more damage right okay so stay tight sit tight and stay put and I'll be just right back okay guys I'm back and um, yeah it was a busy night for me uh, so I've got it let me just turn off the flashlight so I've got it um, some dirt on the way to start uh, to start the farm going on the rooftop and I've been crafting come on and I've been crafting some tools as well and uh, weapons I've made this hatch over here this is the scrap hatch we can further upgrade it to the steel to the vault i believe i've made these awesome crates uh, with some nails got which i've got from um from the forge itself and i have made some arrow iron arrow heads and yeah so let's make a crossbow because this is my preferred weapon uh, when it comes to shooting uh, zombies I don't like the bow and right as you can see I've crafted a bunch of stone access so my level of tools is like uh, one uh, 330 something like that and the weapons are at three 50 as you can see I'm getting hot and I need some drinks I think I have some drinks over here so let's drink that and actually let's make some coffee I've sorted my food and my drinks the drinks are here at the sink and the foods are placed in side inside the fridge just to make it more like a home feel so let's burn, let's make some coffee. It should be enough, but we won't have enough, enough burning time. So let's use the rest of these guys. Let's put away those. Let's drink more water. Golden rod, we're gonna take the golden rod with us. Drink that. Do I have a hunting knife? No, I don't have hunting knife recipe, so I need to make a better bone shift. Uh, I need, I still need to drink some more to keep us hydrated. Come on, 83, and the last one that should be a okay. I'm gonna leave the rest mm, not here, I'm gonna leave the rest over here. I'm gonna scrap this and yeah we have a crossbow so let's make some bolts bolts I said crossbow bolts iron crossbow bolts that's gonna be 22 which is really awesome number and then we can make ourselves as well some more weapons like club barbed wire club or spike Let's actually check which one is better. I think it's gonna be the spike to better, but um, we need some melee weapon anyway. Then we're gonna make some iron axe and a pickaxe. The wrench will stay as it is. And I'm gonna put those in the forge. And let's drop the pipes actually. Because we don't need them right now. The bone shift. Uh, Let's take one bone, we're gonna make a better bone sheath and I need to think about, start thinking about the wellness itself. Recis uh, recipes, bone sheath, craft. Okay, that's gonna be enough. So, as you can see, it's 5 a.m. and I've broken down those fences, uh, not fences, the stairs. 
so this way the zombies if they go up they will fall down because they cannot get me and I can easily place some wood frames over here just like that uh, no I can place the, war f uh, the, the wood frames over here to get on top and I'm gonna no don't do that here here's the one oops sorry here's the one that I wanted to make and I will go down by the down there yeah in the shaft so let's see what's cooking over here nothing is cooking okay so the spike this one the spike club do 35 and this one do 26 so I'm gonna Bend this down, although I don't have that much wood. I hope that's gonna be enough. And I've also made myself mm, a mini bag chassis. Hmm, sweet. So I also made myself a cooking grill already. And we could go actually. Right, that tools pick. First, let's make a pick, and then we're gonna make a better axe. And let's take out. Well, uh, that's gonna be enough. And we're gonna use this. Let's burn this. And we're gonna burn this later on as well. Although I don't know if we're gonna have enough fuel there. Right, so I think we sorted. Come on, burn. I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna burn this as well. That should be enough. Nice pick. Where's the fire axe? It's still being made. Okay. Um, right, so let's continue. It's gonna take a bit to unlock this safe because I don't know what's inside. And I haven't um, I haven't opened it already just yet. And as you can see, I'm getting cold. So this really sucks, the, the, the weather survival thingy. But what can you do? Ooh, August schematics. Nice. So let's read that. And some hunting rifle, as usual. Let's scrap that. Scrap that. And let's scrap that. Okay. So I've made myself a pretty nice tools. I don't have much uh, ammo left. So that's kind of suck. What else? Okay. Mm. Next. Next thing of all, the next order of business is can I repair it? Take it. Can I repair that helmet? Yes, I can. So let's do that so it won't break apart because I don't have any spare, I think. And yeah, let's throw, throw this away. Okay. Mm. Now. We need to continue upgrading our system. So the construction tools level is now 24, as you can see. And the construction tools is uh, over here. So now we can unlock the cement mixer and the workbench, which will... Let's do that. And then the steel smithing will be unlocked when the construction tools level is at 40 so this way we can make a cement mi so now we can make cement mixer and in there we can make concrete mix cement rebar frames i think these are made let me just check are they made in the forge building rebar frame yes so we know that brick Okay, cool. So actually, let's make that cement mixer. Yes, what do we need? Holy, sh holy shit, we need small engine. We've got some springs. We need some scrap cable. Hmm, lots of forged iron and some pipes. And for the workbench, workbench, we're gonna need some springs. Wood, I have short pipes and forged iron. So first let's go over here 
because over here there are springs and the springs are pretty easy to cut what else do we need short pipes and these are over here let's grab those and what else forged iron and i'm gonna need some fire uh, let's take half of this because we need to start making the gunpowder as well hey but that's gonna be done soon right forged iron 25 two minutes start crafting okay that's gonna be enough and i think i will upgrade these so no hornets will come inside and i'm using the stone eggs because this one this way we can upgrade uh, our construction skills because if we go over here and where's that, that construction thingy construction tools do more damage and harvest faster with the construction tools including stone axe wrench hammer and nail gun yeah although the wrench it said the wrench so i might actually use the wrench instead of that stone axe because with the wrench it's, it only takes two oh shit now i need to go out and get and get that hmm and get the wood so let's actually craft additional 25 because i think we're gonna need that much to make that cement mixer cement mixer and scrap cable yeah 25 some springs and a small engine right so right now i think we need to go out get some wood uh, take apart some cars and i'm just gonna do that off camera so we won't you won't waste any any time so i'll be just right back as soon as i get at least some of the stuff so stay tuned right but right guys i'm back and um, yeah it took me a while to get all of the stuff needed but what i have noticed is um that this spite club is really awesome at least at this uh, 350 uh, level with the somewhere around uh, 35 ish uh, entity damage this really really works well uh, but i've killed few hornets and i couldn't loot them and i couldn't loot them not until i took my bone shift out and i was amazed actually that i think now you can get honey of jars um honey of jars <laughs> jar of honey uh, by using the bone shift as you use it uh, when gathering the heights so yeah that's really interesting when it comes to that so fuck i don't have scrap cable um right so uh, <laughs> so i need to go i need to go there really quickly no there and get some cables so bear with me i'll be just right back as soon as i get some cables okay okay so i'm back and <clears throat> that was a quick trip i just entered grabbed uh, deco the decomposed uh, destroyed a few mm, consoles and this way i have free scrap cable so now we can make holy shit it's gonna take a while so i'm gonna make a cement mixer and a workbench which is gonna be the second crafting thing it's gonna take five minutes man that's quite long but i think i'm gonna just grab a few more nails and make myself a couple of storage chests over there and that section and the heat is really insane so i need to check my water and my water and um, food meters so yeah let me just pick up a few paintings as well and put them inside the fort so then so this way the glass can <coughs> can be melted in as well yeah because we're gonna add a shit ton of stuff over here oh 
Stone? What do we need stone for? Business glass block. Cool. Business glass, pane, industrial glass. Nice. Oh, these guys. Okay. So now I'm just looking. Shower glass. I'm just browsing. Oh shit, we're gonna need stones. Stone? How can I make stone? Stone. Stone. Where do I do stone? Can I... Can I add stones? Um... No, right click. Can I burn in stones? I think that's it. I think that's it, so we're gonna... So I need to... Hmm, gather a shit ton of stone as well. Okay, so let's check how these guys are doing. Okay, so I'll be just right back as soon as these are done. Okay guys, I'm back and I've just finished making those um, thingies. I mean the cement mixer, uh, the storage, uh, the workbench and the storage. So let's check them actually out. I'm gonna make my mm, workbench storage thing over here. Well, not that. The right mouse button. So this is the workbench. And the storage mixer, let's put it like so over here. And the storage bin itself, it may be put over here. Right, and fortunately, uh, well, fortunately, uh, once I was getting uh, the small engine, I took apart like 10 or, f or 15, and I fortunately got two small engines. The first one which I got was the quality well level of f 450, and the other one was w 120 or something like that. And fortunately, when I forgot to take the small engine out when I started crafting the cement mixer, which requires the small engine, so uh, the crafting menu, because the small engine was over here, the other one, so the crafting uh, took that uh, 122 quality engine to make this one. So I will stick with this uh, to make the mini bike. So. Let's take a closer look at the cement mixer. So in the cement mixer we can make an asphalt oil shell. Where the hell do I get oil shell? So we can make stones, concrete mix. And for the concrete mix, because there is no gravel anymore, you cannot make a gravel, but well, you can make a gravel in the cement mixer, but you cannot get it while mining stuff uh, so while you're mining mm, these blocks these blocks ordinary blocks in the hub city you won't get gravel but you, nowadays you will get stone and the crushed sand as you can see i have that but you can make crushed sand out of the stones a small stone as well so let's make one oh oh nice sound so let's make a gravel. It takes a while. So we can make an asphalt. The gravel stone. Cool. This is really awesome. Oh, and I love the sound. Is there an output? Yes, it's over here. So what can I do with the gravel? The gravel like rocks, only smaller. Mm. Right, so I've cooked some stone and made some cement as well. So we might actually make some concrete mix. Oh, 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 Fucking hell. Fucking hell. That's not good. 
That is not good at all. Well, I guess I'll try to get it, but I don't think I will. Well, at least not now. It's day four, so I completely forgot about it. The farm is growing, so that's good. Man, I completely forgot about the ad drop date. Okay, so we know pretty much how the cement mixer works, concrete mix, and I don't know. We're gonna test it out in the next uh, next video, but let's have a closer look at the workbench. And in the workbench, you can make additional stuff. Metal sign. Oh, nice. Oh, cool. So I can name my base. This is cool. Mobile spotlight is made in here. Plant fiber, pressure plate, reinforced metal siding. Good. Good. What else can we make? Scrap iron table. Nice. This is really nice addition. So you can have a shit ton of these stuff. Uh, crafting wood frames and other things. Which takes a long time. All the wooden clubs. <laughs> wonder uh, it's gonna be put in the output so it's gonna stop after those six so you cannot oh okay fair enough yeah because we're close so yeah okay fair enough but you can craft a bunch of stuff over here which is really good which is really good Concrete, adobe pitch, full corner, adobe with pillar. So, as you can see, you can craft pretty much everything, which and animal hide stuff as well. Animal hide clothing provides sound protection against cold weather and does a fair job against other damage types. Good, good. Barbed wire, bellows, blunderbuss. So this is another. Uh, this is additional crafting sections. Fancy toilet. Oh, cool. Bucket of water. Great. First aid kit. Okay. Forest ground. Hmm. That's interesting. Grassy ground. So the oh oh oh. Gun safe. We can also make make a gun safe. Good, good, good to know. So I probably I'm gonna make a shit ton of those. I'm gonna take apart this this section, and probably I'm just gonna put in here the work uh, stations because I don't know if the concrete also now requires uh, each block if it requires ten cement mix, ten cement mix, which is made over here. In, because if it does, that's gonna suck, and we're gonna need a shit ton of scratch sand. Man, that's gonna take so many materials. Anyway, guys, so that's gonna be it for today's episode. Unfortunately, we didn't get that edge rope, and probably it's long gone, so I'm not gonna go there just yet. It's half a day already, so yeah, we will continue our adventure later on in the next episode. And now I just need to think about it. What we going to do? Probably I, I will spend some time somewhere around the, uh, somewhere around here. And during the night time, I will go, go to the other apartment building, which is over here, and loot it, because I'm still lacking those shotgun slugs, uh, recipe. Yeah. Okay, guys. So that's gonna be it for today's episode. As usual, like, subscribe, comment, and support. And thanks for watching, and I hope I'll see you around in the next episode. So till then, take it easy, have fun, and happy gaming. My name is Borek, and I'm looking off. See you later.